this is the same store that we saw chickens at. Um, we have now come across, uh, we, we were actually scared that we were gonna get pulled over. Don't worry. Um, these, this vehicle here has the, uh, it is a booty patrol. <laughs> It's like, good thing you, we weren't out there walking around when, the, when he was around because then it would have been pulled over. He must be inside. So today, um, we're going to do a, um, a palm tree identification day for those of you who don't know. So when we get to certain yards, we'll um, identify uh, the palm tree in that yard. Florida has the biggest array of like palm trees I've ever seen in my life. Actually, up until I came to Florida, I only thought there was two kinds of uh, palm trees. The, the palm tree that looks like it's a little fan hand, it's a little fan. The really long palm trees I see in the Corona commercials. Like a coconut palm. Probably. Yeah, it's a coconut palm. Coconut palm. The only two palm trees I thought that were really existed in in America or in any kind of tropical setting. Thought there was only two kinds of palm trees. Turns out I was wrong. There's a bunch of them. The in being here, I've learned a few of them, um, and we're going to get into some of those. Uh, can you tell us, uh, Cameron, uh, well, how many types of palm trees that you know of uh, exist here in Florida? Well, I don't know exactly how many, but I can start naming off types. Sure thing. Go ahead. You got the cabbage palm. Those are edible. You can you can cut them when they're like I'd say no 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 more than twelve foot tall, and you can cut the heart out and eat it like cabbage. Put it in soups. You put it in you can put it in hush puppies, and it's good stuff. Um, Queen palms. The most common one you see in yards. I don't know if it's because they're cheap or what. I don't like them because they're not self-shedding. So they always they need to be trimmed like twice a year. But a lot of people don't do that, so they just drop their branches and look like crap. Then you got a royal palm. Once with the, with the green stem up top by the by the branches, then you got a foxtail palm. Then you got an adenidia or a Christmas uh, pineapple palm, the Lester palm, the Washingtonian. Gotta be more, but I'm not. Oh, um, pick me day palm. Those are everywhere, too. Yeah, I hate those things. They have thorns. They have thorns, they have to be trimmed. They look like crap if they haven't been trimmed. That's another one people, people, um, kind of neglect and then they look stupid. So, what about the Eureka thingies? Oh, Eureka is a type of palm. Yep. Shed a whole bunch. That shit a lot. They're good for uh, for privacy. A lot of people call them rat palms because rats live in them. Because there's so much dead foliage in the, on the inside of them. <coughs> uh, what what about those triangle thingies that look like kind of like uh, Birds of Paradise? Is it Birds of Paradise? Banana trees look like palm trees, but they're banana trees. Yeah, they're banana trees. So. There's a foxtail. Yeah, it's a foxtail. Christmas palm. Mm -hmm. 
Kev Palm. Might have named it. Oh, Palm. the Silver. Silver Bismarck. That's the most expensive one. Yeah, that one's actually ginormous. It's a it really is. big palm tree. The mature one, the, the branches on it are huge. We have one we trim regularly. And it's a pain in the butt. Yeah. It's ginormous. But they're pretty. They're silver. Yeah, they're really cool looking. They're just ginormous. There's one right there. Yep. There's one of the triangle palms. There's more. It's pineapple. Pineapple palms are cool. Mm -hmm. They gotta be trimmed up a lot too though. I, myself, I like the self-shedding palms, like the foxtail and the Christmas palm. Just cause they're nicer, they're, they stay clean. You just pick up the branches when they fall off. Or when they dangle, you just pull them off. But as a, a uh, queen palm, you have to trim it. Pineapple palm, you have to trim it. They're way more maintenance. But they look good when they're done. That's all that matters. And we know how to trim them. Our teeth and a ladder. That's right. Jump up there and just gnaw them down. <laughs> Random rate man. Having fun? Yeah. Alright people. Another end to an amazing week of kingdom cutting. Um, maybe hire us to do your yard. Palm tree. Call us for a quote. Yeah, you know, we'll come out, check it out, see what we can do. And uh, you guys have a blessed day. Alright. Bye. Keen the cutters out.